Have you read your own about section or bio or description in your social media profiles lately? This is my reminder to you that that is a great step to take. In fact, I put it on my calendar for many times throughout the year to go back and take a look at what I have written about myself in the social media channels where I have a presence. I also do this for learning management systems or any type of a place where your potential customers or clients or fellow coworkers might be visiting and reading about you. As I have been teaching about live streaming and how to engage with your followers, I was realizing that that's a step that I had missed covering and I wanted to bring it up for you. As people are engaging with you in a live stream and if you've piqued their interest in something, they may go take a look at your about section to read more about what you do or how you might work in their organization or how you might provide some coaching or consulting services. So make sure that information is up to date. I hope that you will join me in going out over the next few days and take <laughs> our cat just attacked my leg because I was ignoring him. <laughs> Sorry kitty. I'll pet you in a second. That's kitty pigs. I hope you will join me over the next few days and check all of those about sections, descriptions, bios, and make sure that they are saying what you want them to say. And if you haven't done this, create a Google Doc or a document in Dropbox or some place like that where you can store a document and easily get to it and copy and paste those about sections for each of the different platforms where you have one located. Because some of them have different character links that you can use. You might want to phrase things differently for one platform than you would for another. So copy and paste each one of them in that document and then you can easily see where you have bios or descriptions that you need to go check and also you can borrow what you've already written as you're creating a new document for some other purpose. I use that document in my Google Drive more than any other document that's out there. I'm constantly going out and taking a look at what I had already written and grabbing the most updated version of something and then plopping it into another document that I need to send to somebody or maybe I've joined a new social media channel and instead of having to rethink it I just go out and grab that one I've already written copy and paste it into the new channel maybe make a few updates but it really speeds the process along so join me in taking a look at those about sections make sure they're current Mark your calendar for several times throughout the year when you're going to go through this process and revisit them and save your descriptions in some type of an easily accessible document. You'll save yourself a lot of time.